this are we going we're going we're, we're here it's here we're here it's recording it's recording it's the future it is mr maximus black yeah this is a three-way free-for-all insane cheater ai yep the magic is about to go down on elysium a map that nobody has seen since the dawn of starcraft 2 mm. mr maximus black yeah hit me up with the sound of being a kid in a wheelchair playing oh. dodgeball Pass me the ball! Now I'm good. Okay? Okay. <laughs> I like how you went with the route where it doesn't end up getting him just pummeled with, with I, I I didn't want to go I didn't want to go there. Didn't I, didn't want, I didn't want to get that dark. I didn't want to go there. Alright. Alright, you've already you already went that dark when God. you when you screwed that kid in the wheelchair I would have been many I years been, ago. Uh, phrasing. <laughs> freezing, freezing. Uh, I would have been fired so fast for putting a friggin' wheelchair kid in dodgeball. Would have been. You'd have been fired real quick. I, I feel like it might have been worth though, just for the story. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, until the kid literally is a god at dodgeball because he's got all upper strength and he's just That's wrecking right. everyone. Do you ever watch the show Vikings? No, but I am going to. So dude, don't spoil it. Dude's pretty good. Okay. One of the one of the uh, the sons can't use his legs. And so he just crawls around his arms all day. And he's gone. That's the kind of strength. Wow. So there, there is the uh, the straw poll, guys. You can blue, uh, you can um, vote on blue, red, or pink. So we do have pink. It's going to be a three-way free for all. I thought since well, blue has already won everything. We're we're going to play for for fun. Yeah. And we're going to do a three-way. Now, if blue wins this too. Blue is just epic. If blue wins this, I'm to I'm tossing in the towel. If pink wins, I'm calling it a technicality red win. Okay, so it's basically... <laughs> it's a two-on-one. It's two-on-one. Okay. Yeah. So, three-way uh, free-for-all here. We're just going to observe the uh, the madness. Now, will the two reds try and tackle the blue? Or will they all just be attacking each other? I'm very curious to see how, they, how it all plays out. It looks like we already have some aggressiveness. Ha oh, no, never mind. Those are just drones. Just two lings. Just... Nothing fancy. Yeah, they're all look. Every one of them that got units just sitting at the ramp. Nothing fancy. Just keeping guard here. Bob is trying to do his job. That's a lot of work for one Bob. That is a whole. I, I lot feel of work. like the union is failing Bob right now. And mm. uh, that's there's the second one. That's not really making life a hell of a lot better. So it looks like we got 111 votes in already, and white at 51 percent. You know what would be really cool if we had some like stats that showed up on the screen where we could it like updates it as it's going. It would be. How cool would that be? I mean, we could. It's called the screen region, but uh, I don't think the... You have to refresh in order to see yeah. this. It's not like Twitter polls that are live. You can't yeah. see them live, so... There you go, XSplit. Why don't you make a poll thing so that you can a set... A live poll. A live polling on on XSplit, and then when they when they do it, it updates on XSplit. There you go. Bio straw poll. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's kind of... That's a cool idea. Enter it in. It's a cool idea. Win at life. So it looks as though Adam... Red was the number one contender, and now nobody. Sh I'm not even voting for red. Twenty-one percent of people are voting for red I'm now. On, Twenty. I'm on that pink hype. Uh, Fifty percent on white. Thirty percent on blue. So we'll see. We've got a Terran up here in the top left, Protoss up there in the top right, and a Zerg why, down bottom. Why the fuck is red Protoss every single game? I don't know, man. That is some crazy fucking math. Mm. Somebody run the probability uh, fucking... Uh, well, it's 50% every time. What do you mean 50% every 50 time? 50 50. You had a 50 50. Or no, never mind. It's, it's three. A 50, it's 50 three. 50 50? Three, three ways. Three ways. Yeah, it's 33.333% so 33 33 chance. Well, that would be it. Every single time. But it's it's three choose one, but it's three choose one for like every match that we've had. It doesn't matter because for things like that... It's it's a new one every single time. Yes, but but uh, no, it's, no, it's not that order matters. It's that it's that it's happening consecutively. Yeah, but it's still the same amount of probability every time. Yes, well, there's a no, there's a probability for it happening in a singular match, and then there's a probability for that for that to happen multiple matches in a row. That's a different that's a different thing okay. altogether. Okay. I thought it would just count as a new one every time. It's like a coin flip, right? Well, when, you, when you do a coin flip, it is 50-50, and then it, there, it's not... I don't think there's a different... Like, there isn't for, for, for each, it to for hit, each coin yeah, yeah, yeah. flip. But, then, but if, it hits, if it hits heads three times in a row, is that a different That's probability? Different, yes. 
Yeah. Okay. Okay. It, it would be. It would be. I think it's like literally point five times point five times point five times point five or some shit. Okay. Or I thought it just counted like there is no probability. It's like it's like betting on uh on red or black in roulette. It's like a a if I just stick with black, eventually it's gonna hit red, right? But I've seen black go for you know forever, and they're like you you shouldn't do it on that because it's basically a new spin every time. Yeah, I haven't done I haven't done probability since university. It's been a while. Okay, but I'm pretty sure it's it's like for a coin flip. Which I mean, if you're some asshole in chat's gonna be the party pooper and be like, actually, guys, one side of the coin is weighted heavier than the other, so it's not a perfect 50-50. But ignoring that point, hmm. um, yes, I believe it's like it's something along those lines, fifty. Point five times point five times point five or some nonsense like that. But yeah. Okay. Anyway. I I I know I, I understand. I yeah. understand. Like, I guess I was just thinking that it would be the same thing every time. But it, I guess it is a less of a probability harder to hit heads every five times time. in a row. Yes, exactly. Right. That is yes. That's yeah. exactly it. Yep. Yep. I get it. I get it. Well, I we got we got some armies amassing everywhere. Adam, I'm dumb. All right. <laughs> All right, bro. You can't. Dumb, I'm dumb, and dumb, I. You know what? I own it, bitch. But you're not. But you're not dumb. There, you'd only be dumb if you were, if, if, like, if, if you were willfully ignorant. It's not like you were taught how to do that shit. It's not like you mm. can't. You can't blame somebody. That'd be like that's like looking at a newborn baby and like be, motherfucker, do multivariable calculus, mm. bitch. Mm. And they're looking at you like I can't even say dad yet. The mm. fuck are you talking about? Mm. This is the totally different thing. All right, thank you for you're picking not, up my you're spirits. Not, you're not stupid, bro. Stop being such a millennial. Tell me I'm dumb, Adam. You can't. The you, world out there you is a tough place. You can't read names though. That's fucked. I up. can't read you names. Can't, that's, I'm that's, pretty that's, fucking dumb, yeah, that's bro. Dumb, I'm, that's hey, I own it, bro. That. I don't care. I love it. I love it. All right. Dumb is fun. <laughs> so, ignorance is bliss. It is. It is. <laughs> Protoss, they all three of these guys got armies, and I don't know why he continues to want to sit in this in his main like this. Um, I it's all gonna boil. I think what it's gonna boil down to: two guys are gonna fight, yes. and then the last guy is gonna go. <laughs> well, this is like seven v one comp stomps when you and I would just sit back and let yeah. everybody else do the work, and then we just like power fuck the whole team, and be like, "But who's the one that's doing it? Who's who's unallied victory?" It's me. It's me. Blame it on somebody else. Oh, he attacked Bitch. me, guys. Get him. Get no, him. I didn't do shit. He like, hit my line. You didn't. Got him. <laughs> this is, uh, well, Gullible. this is this is uh, going to kill the Zerg army. Um, this here is going to kill the Zerg army. Um, this, man, it's close. This is a close fight between these two. Just because these Hellbats are going to be able to soak so much damage, it's going to boil down to these force fields against this. But these siege tanks out back are going to do a lot. But it looks like Protoss is opting to go screw it. The Overlords are going to get attacked here, and most likely Pink is going to run out of their main to try and stop this. Okay, he doesn't care. Okay, there we go. There we go. Now he's moving. All right. Here comes the attack. This is a really bad position for Zerg. Really, really bad. Here probably comes some force fields. A preemptive storm going down here, but doesn't really hit a whole lot. One decent force field. Would like to get another one and then move these units away from this side. Yeah, but who would do that though, Jeff? Why wouldn't you just walk right up the ramp and yeah. cluster all of your literally units just, together and just let the mixtapes? He just literally just threw that bomb you from orbit and then get then get sandwiched here. Oh by my the god! Blue Terran, and, and blue then, is and now then coming. Terran's gonna a move up the ramp and win. Oh my goodness. All the infestors' energy happening. has been used. The this siege tanks happening. are sieging. These infestors are going to take it. Oh my god, that was huge! What a fucking fungal! Pink with the maximum fucking efficiency on that fungal. But these siege Smashed tanks everything. and the marauders are still here. Not even any medevacs oh to even help out. God. Still doing a lot of damage. It looks as though Zerg will be able to hold. Uh, but damn, they did a lot of damage. Red's playing like me. That's bad. You, sh <laughs> you shouldn't do that. You shouldn't uh, do that. It is what it is. You shouldn't be doing that shit. Bro, Blue's getting battle cruisers. Yep. And he's upgrading them. Zerg is getting Ultralisks and a Greater Spire as he's dying. Red's just getting fucked. Well, you know what? Red's actually in the best position right now because he gets to sit back and just chill. Yeah, but he might not do that. He might just actually go ahead and just keep streaming oh, units in. Blue backed off. Yeah, he did. Blue backed away. He let Pink live for another day. He's gonna reinforce here. So we've got a game. Nobody died. There was a lot of action. Some really bad play there from Red, uh, of course. 
Oh, absolutely. Uh, did not know. And this was like a perfect engagement for him, too. A couple of force fields, back off, hit the storm, keep force fielding. His sentries were max um, energy. And he could have easily have just taken this off and bounced or even took another fight and just let half of the units come down. But instead, he just funneled everything here and took some big fungals and had those mixtapes dropping all over him. That hot fire, oh, yeah. that trap music fire that we heard there Absolute, on the last cast just came back. Absolute fire, bro. Pure flames. Pure. And we've got a couple of Marines. This is kind of a, a fucky looking map. There's like a circle that goes all the way around. This just seems like, like a Liberator Heaven and Siege Tank Heaven. Just to sit back here with some high ground vision and just wreck everything. Like you've got the mineral lines, both of them, just chilling here. It just seems like a bad life choice. Definitely seems like a nice Terran favored map. <laughs> it does. <laughs> What blue is always fucking Terran. Red is always fucking Protoss. Yep. And nobody cares about Zerg. Oh my god. Zerg is never creep spreading. No. He only creep spreads when he's winning. Yeah. Okay. And then he's like, alright, I'll think about that it. That is another scary army. Alright, now that's now if you fuck this up. That is a very scary army. Very scary. If you fuck this up. It's Red. lucky these tanks didn't aggro that. Yeah, it was just that, like that right was off. Really freaking close. Because that army would have just gotten melted. That's a lot of our time. Okay, Zerg is so dead. Yeah, this is rip, bro. Zerg is so dead on so many levels of death. The He's ultras are out, but there's nothing there to help him. And the and the cavern is in a horrible spot. He's oh, gonna lose right that up tech. Front. He's not gonna be able to do anything about that. He's gonna Red's gonna lose that one. Oh, the storm on the ramp though! Yeah. Will he get another one off? He loses there an Archon. it is. That's there a big storm. Is. That's a good storm. He's just throwing these Archons up. He's even fucking hallucinating other Archons right mm. now, Jed. That one Immortal, or the um, Ultralisk is trying to get in behind here. And Protoss is going to be able to finish off this army, but here comes Blue oh, again. No. Blue's this that cheeky little Blue player. Blue, Blue's friggin' letting everybody else do the work. Yep. And then here he comes. Look at this. And this is ripped for red. Three man fight. Red's putting in all this work and Blue's gonna come in and clean it up. Oh Look at this. my god. Look at this. Insta death. Get wrecked. Savagery. Dead. Brutal. Dead. Savage. Dead. Wrecked. Dead. And now Blue just finishes off yep. what's left of pink. Yup. Wow. Blue Red, is just. Red's got some time to build up some oh, units. Whoa, 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 whoa. We got something going on out oh, here. Oh, there. Well, this is the reinforcements from Red meeting okay. up with the reinforcements from Blue. Here's the thing. Will Red go and attack the Blue base and no. force Blue to back off? That would be too easy. That would be too easy. No, he's going to go in here and get fucked by a line of siege tanks or just stand with a bunch of zealots <laughs> on the low ground and just get shot. There we go. Look, look. What there's, are you doing? There's the siege tanks. Look at that. Why are you so dense? There we go. Okay, he's backing off. Hot damn! Ghost's gonna pick one of those zealots off. That zealot's oh, salt. Oh my goodness. And Zerg is gonna go down here, guys. So it is gonna boil down to blue and red again. Man, this ain't blue and red. This is, this is, we're in blue's world and everybody else is just living in it. And people on the stream voted, 50% voted. White was gonna take it. 48% white well, was gonna take it. They weren't wrong. Or pink. White, pink did take it. Oh yeah, they took it hard. <laughs> He took it hard. Yeah. Look at this long-range mining. Just SCVs everywhere. Red, yeah. though, is building up another sizable army. Yeah, but Red's going to fucking run in circles or something. Probably. You just watched Red throw away, like, 14 zealots up against the side of a cliff mm. to attack with one immortal. That's what we just witnessed. Well, the upgrades for blue and red are the same at 1-1 one, one each. I don't want to ruin it, though, uh, but you see you see all those zealots? They're not going to do a lot against a battlecruiser. No, they're not. Those Archons will deal deal some damage with the Stalkers. If we can get off a... Uh, oh, yeah, the, the, and the Battlecruisers don't have energy anymore. They're energyless. There's no more feedback. Rip the dream. Rip the dream. So that's that's pretty huge. Oh, and that's just defeated. Wrecked. Nowhere's to run. Wiped off the map. Oh, my God. Wow, Red oh. is actually playing smart. Wow, he actually Moving cleaned that up. Moving out for the counterattack. Oh, Nothing back big. at base, Adam. This could be big. Blue's coming back, but it's going to take some time for him to get there, and Red's going to have a slight positional oh advantage. The Zealots are going up deep into the base. The oh rest of the God. units are down on the low ground, but this could be bad for Red if he doesn't choose to get up on the high ground. He's fucked. Oh, my God. Red Red needs to not be there. He needs to not get caught over the, here. the opposite of where he wants to be right now. 
Oh god. The complete opposite. Oh god. He's literally doing the opposite of what needs to happen. If he gets hit by an EMP here, he's in trouble. He's in trouble. Blue though! What is he doing? Blue, where are you going? Okay, now? there oh, it is. The There's the siege button. Oh, no. Rip, rip, rip. It's gonna be close if he can get these two immortals no, in the no, 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 no. There's a lot of siege tanks, bro. Yep, nice. And I don't know if you remember this, but siege tanks got a mad buff in this patch. Mm. And they're doing huge damage. Mm, just melted. And just here it comes. No, no, you don't want to throw uh, that. No, you don't, don't want to throw that away. You don't want to throw that away, don't Red. Don't throw that away. You that, don't want to go there. That raven didn't even die. Oh, God. That raven didn't even die. That raven got out alive. Oh, my goodness. Fuck. Fuck Red. Yup. Even when he's ahead, he goes out of his way to get wrecked. Literally uh, goes out of his way to get smashed. I mean, we still have a game going here. It's 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 a game that is still going. Dude, there are five like battle cru battle cruisers now. Dude, this guy even got the base down here in the bottom right. Oh, he's got everything going. He's got it all going. Mm. I don't know, man. I feel as though if he gets enough void rays here. If he gets enough voids, this will be a win for our Protoss. He's got a lot of siege. He's got Hellbats. Very few Marines. Uh, it's just these battle cruisers, and, and void rays can eat up the BCs if you got enough of them. Now the BCs will be able to use the the tomato cannon or whatever we called it. Yeah, the, the yeah, tomato cannon, the Yoda yo tomato, the yo, the yo tomato, cannon. yo tomato cannon. Yeah. Uh, but I think enough void rays might actually do it, especially with the Archons. Remember that time He's got the high that, ground. He's got the high ground remember here. Remember that time that he built immortals against... Oh, oh, oh. Oh, the snipes, oh. the EMPs. It's going to be close. It's going to be close. Dude, there's like a thousand siege tanks, man. There's a thousand siege tanks. Yeah. I'm trying to hype it, man. I'm yeah, no, there's no there's no hype here. Red sucks dick. <laughs> Red gets Protoss I'm, every game, and he sucks a dick. I'm trying Blue to hype. Blue gets every game... And just gets fed. Oh man, this is a scam. Yeah, I, I feel I feel as though I was having a day nine moment. I don't know if you remember the game that I played on main stage MLG against Liquid Tyler. Oh yeah, he was trying to hype you. And up. he was hyping me up. And DJ Wheat, just he was, was just slamming you. Oh yeah, he he didn't like. There was no hype. And he was like, Nah, day no. nine, he's fucked. Yeah. Pretty much like. Oh no, DJ had, DJ Wheat had. He no was keep, he was keeping it a hundred. He was keeping it a hundred. Yeah. You know what I mean? No chill. He wasn't even giving the fine folks at home an opportunity for hope. He wasn't even no. giving the fellowship that opportunity to think, "Wow, my boy has really done it. We started from the bottom. Now he's here. He might just do it." Day Day Nine himself is giving hope, and everyone's like, "Hey, if Day Nine's saying it, it's got to be real, right?" And DJ's yeah. like, "No, actually." No, uh, no, Maximus Black is no, he's dead. He's dead. That's it. Black people can't play StarCraft too. He didn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but that's what he was thinking. <laughs> uh, no, was, no chill from DJ no, Wheat. no chill, no, no chill. chill, no chill. Get fucked. Zero chill. Get fucked. Still love him, but no chill. To be fair, you did get fucked. I got hard. fucked pretty hard. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. It was bad time. He was not giving the fine folks at home any false hope. He just no. keeps it real. There was no millennial. No. It was no. He's a loser. There was yeah. yeah I mean, he loses. He doesn't it. deserve to be here. There he's a no, loser. There is no ribbon for Maximus Black. No, there is none. It's called last place. No Take free it. passes here, boys. Mm, I actually didn't get last place. I won a. I won a round. It's true. So. Uh, That's true. It happened. I might have been like top fifty. Nailed it. That's the pinnacle of my StarCraft career, Ball man. Ball so hard. I remember that day. That was fire, dude. I was so pumped. I cringed a bit. Uh, I bet you did. I almost threw up in the booth. Legit. <laughs> yeah. I had the shits. Like, whenever I get really nervous, I get the Hershey's. Oh, and yeah. And I had to take a shit before I... Man, it was like... It was like fucking running out my ass. And then I get there and I almost throw up. I was so I was so excited and nervous. Like, I didn't even care to win or lose. I just couldn't believe where I was at. You're just on stage. I was like, oh, my God. Whoa, what, what is this? Stop the madness. And then uh, DJ Week gave me a whole... Uh, uh, a full dose of reality. Oh, oh, it was, oh, it was a hundred. It was a hundred and ten percent of your daily recommended intake of reality. Yes, it was too much reality for Dumped me. Dumped it on you, something fierce. It's an episode of the Kardashians. Oh no, don't no. It's that ain't much. reality. No, that's the opposite of reality. No. Well, um, 
Blue went, takes it. Blue I takes mean, it you know again. what? For shits and giggles, I'm 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 literally at I'm chalking one up for blue. Chalk one up for blue. Do it. I'm doing it again. Even it. even in a three man free for all. Blue is still winning. Blue is still pulling out all the stops. Six to one, guys. Read them and weep. Read them and weep. Uh, all right. Well, we still got another three games left in us. I have an idea. What do you have? Next game, mm -hmm. everything, you know, random builds and shit, same difficulty. Red is Terran, blue is Pro Protoss. Oh. This is the, this is, this is, we gotta see. Is red really just trash? Oh. Or is Terran AI OP? I see where you're going with this. Yeah. Because literally, like, every game has been blue Protoss, or blue Terran and red Protoss. Okay. Like, every single game. Okay. I'll do that. All right, guys. We'll be right back right after this. Make sure to go and sign up on the giveaway in the description of the video. And uh, we will see you guys on the next one. Sit tizzity. You may be expecting to see ting plans. We don't do plans. We do rates. Plans require you to guess how many minutes, messages, and megabytes of data you're going to use each month. If you use more than you thought you would, you're punished. If you use less, you're wasting money. Unless you have a magic eight ball that tells you exactly how much you're going to use, a plan can be a losing proposition. Instead of offering plans, Ting's simple rates adjust to how much or how little you use each month. On Ting, minutes, messages, and megabytes of data are independent of each other. You only pay for the level you reach for each one. If you go over one month, you switch to pure per unit pricing. If you don't use any text messages, you don't pay for any text messages. If you use less than 100 megabytes of data one month, you pay for less than 100 megabytes of data that month. As a result, your monthly Ting bill can be different from month to month as your usage changes. Use less, and you'll pay less. Use more, and you'll pay a little more. Best of all, one account can have multiple phones under it. All your phones draw from the same pool of minutes, messages, and megabytes. An active phone costs just $6 per month. The more phones on your account, the less you pay per phone on average. $6 per phone on your account, plus whatever you use that month, plus only those taxes and fees were legally required to remit on your behalf, equals your monthly Ting bill. Ting doesn't charge recovery, admin, or any other cash grab fees. On Ting, we want you to save money, and we made it easy to do. By using Wi-Fi at home or at work, you avoid using mobile data when you don't need to. So just by turning on Wi-Fi on your phone, you save money. We also give you tools that put you in control, so you can save even more. We've made it easy to set rules for an individual phone, or for your account as a whole. Creating one of these rules is as simple as completing a sentence. For example, say you want to be alerted the moment your phone has used 200 voice minutes. When dad's phone exceeds 200 minutes, do this, email. Take it a step further by setting a cap. Caps allow you to turn off specific services on a specific phone when it reaches a level you choose. For example, 